What up boys and welcome back to another video. So as always, every single Monday we take a look at my Transmog tune on my main realm, Arch at Dawn, and we see how much gold we've made and how many auctions we've sold. So Transmog the last, I don't know, six, seven weeks probably have been really bad for me in my realm. But uh, then again, I've been making a lot of gold on my my other bank tunes, like both materials and the bank tune where I sell like all the battle pets and seal tomb of lost legion and battery tilts and all of that. So this week I was also gone for two days fishing, just like last week. Uh, we did sell two hundred and fifty four auctions, but I'm not expecting uh, that much gold due to being away uh, two days. It wasn't in the weekend this time though. So that probably helped. Uh, I see that I sold one of the shields from uh, yesterday's video, the uh, TBC uh, chests. So that's kind of cool, selling that fast. And well, I sold both of them actually. Let's see, 8.4k rugged polearm. Eye of Flame from my um, 10 hours of BRM, like the 21 epics video. I still have two left then. Then there's just a bunch of low sales. Warbear Woolies. 81,000 gold on the first 100 auctions. So uh, if it keeps on going like this, we're going to make 200,000 gold. Which uh, is definitely not a lot of gold. Considering my 2,350 uh, auctions that's up on the auction house. Let's see. Did I say a big? 11k. Big sale, mm-hmm. 11k is a big sale for me these days. That's how bad it's become. Quillward, someone bought these from RFD, 400 gold. Wow. All right, let's see. So the next 100 auctions is actually over 100,000 gold, 113. Tager Sword on the Stick. I think this is one of the blue items from Watt, from doing Iron Docks. I'm not quite sure about that one. Style and purple hat, less than 2,000 gold. Let's see. Dark Rune Gauntlets and Wild Torn Mail, both for like 8.5-ish. Both crafted. Fell Steel Longblade! Sold for 22,000 gold. Mm. Well, I don't even need to start to tell you guys how bad that is. 8.9 for a Nightfall. Crystal Weave Bracers. I think it's one of the depleted bracers from uh, Farming in Blade's Edge. I see a uh, Sulfur and Hammer as well in the next clean out. 35,000 gold. God, I miss the days when this one would easily sell for over 100,000 gold. But I've sold it for less. I've sold it for less. And yeah, it could have been worse. Can always get worse. Let's see. Couple more auctions to clean out. This might actually be a good last clean out. Huh. Like 170k ish? 164,000 gold on the uh, the last clean out. White Cloud Belt, 38k crafted. Titan Seal Destroyer, 10k crafted. 42,000 gold for a Sage Blade. Finally, something big. And then also the crafted belt. But 164,000 gold. Like. We did make like 170,000 gold, 160,000 gold, 360,000 gold, of course. So better than uh, better than last week, actually. Not bad, not bad. With two days away this week, 360,000 gold. Yeah, almost spot on. Anyways. That was it for today's video. If you guys got any questions, as always, just leave them down in the comment section and I'm going to do my best to answer every single one of them. Until tomorrow's video, boys. Bye-bye.